Hi, good evening, my friend. Today, I'm going to share with you how to make fruit enzyme. It is a very popular health supplement, which you can do it at home. I have prepared a few types of fruits here. That is pineapple, green apple, red grapes, and lemon. The most important ingredients in enzyme making is lemon and sugar. You can either use white sugar, molasses sugar, brown sugar, or honey. This recipe of mine does not require any water mixture. It is purely from the fruits and sugar. I will also need two empty jars which I have already washed and dried. It is about two liter. And I need to emphasize that all these fruits have to be washed and air dried because it will cause more to grow during fermentation. Now I'm going to deseed the grapes. Before that, you need a knife and the chopping board which is dry and oil free you can remove the skin if you want to first of all I'm going to peel the lemon skin. I only need this yellow part, the yellow skin, to enhance the flavor. Then now, I'm going to cut and peel off the white part because this is bitter. It's going to make your enzyme bitter. After removing the white part, I'm going to slice it thinly and remove all the seeds. The ratio of the fruits is 1 kg to 700 gram of sugar. So now I'm going to weigh the fruits. The first layer is the sugar. Just slightly squeeze grapes. And now you pull a lemon. Repeat the same thing for the rest. You can only fill in 70% of the jar because during the fermentation, the juice of the uh, these fruits will keep on rising. This is the final layer. Beside the red grapes, I've also prepared this uh, the combination of pineapple, green apple, and lemon. And another one is pure, purely lemon. So let's get started. 
So this pineapple, I'm going to use this molasses sugar. So the bottom layer, put all the sugar. Then the pineapple. A layer of pineapple. And a layer of sugar. lemon Lastly, put the sugar on the top layer. As for now, I'm going to leave this to ferment for 2 to 3 weeks. You don't have to keep this in a dark cabinet. As for me, I just leave it in my dining area. On a daily basis, I will open up the lid to release the gas and use a wooden spoon to stir it twice a day. So now I'm going to mark the date on the bottle. So these are the enzymes which I have made last month. So these are the dragon fruit with lemon, apple with lemon, apple, pineapple and lemon, mango and lemon, pineapple and lemon. Yes, everything is with lemon. So I keep it in the fridge with the lid open. Do not close it because there are still gases in it. So me and my family will consume it daily, twice a day, one hour before lunch and one hour before sleep. Tonight, let's drink apple and lemon enzyme. We can only use porcelain or wooden spoon so this is one tablespoon I'm adding in a cup of water let's drink I hope you enjoy my video and please remember to like and subscribe my YouTube channel at Mommy's Secret Recipe, Mama the Waiter. Thank you. So this is the second day of the enzyme making. And this is the grape with the lemon. Can you see the liquid is rising up? And this is the pure lemon. And this is the apple with the pineapple and lemon using molasses sugar. So now I'm going to share with you how to release the gas and stir the enzyme. First is by 
opening out the lid, use a wooden spoon, make sure that it is dry and stir it. Then you will see some bubbles. Usually, there will be more bubbles on the fifth day onwards. You can use the same spoon on all the enzymes.